Okay, we're on to our next thing. Now we're going to do the driver search and stuff for the plug and play monitor. Next. Search for these drivers recommended. Um, CD-ROM drive. And possibly C. Next. Check in floppies. Now it has found the driver for that, so next. Finish. Now it's doing the Windows 98 setup again. It's updating the system settings. Personal personalized settings. Now it's putting all the icons and setting up all the start menu stuff. And we have color, shockingly. Okay, but we have no sound, so uh, what a ripoff. You know, I can't re remember what I did with the E-Machines uh, CD-ROM. You know, you know, like, I swear to God I had a CD-ROM for this thing. Like, this thing, um... Came with a CD-ROM when I bought it. It said E-Machines on it, and I don't know what I did with it. Like, it's all coming back to me now. When, like, when I first got this thing, I had the drivers for the network card, video card, the sound card. I have drivers for everything. Um, but unfortunately, uh, I think I lost it. Could be in here, like the driver CD. Like, I'm. 100% sure it is in here somewhere. It was a long time ago I had all the computers stacked up over there and I had the seat oh oh there it is oh my god wow wow I'm so lucky this thing with uh, orange tape on it And this is for the E-Tower 466iX, 500i, and 500iX. Well, this one apparently is the newest than all of those. So there's the original CD-ROM for it. And it has all the sound drivers and stuff like that. One of these days I'm going to install Windows 98 on this machine and um, install the sound drivers and stuff for it because you know like I got color which is one like which is the one thing but I'm pretty sure I can get sound working on here one person commented on one of my videos and said dude almost all of his computers in his room have no sound or color installed on them well this will probably be the first Windows well, second Windows 98 computer in this room to have sound and color on it. Huh. Imagine that, just putting the original operating system on this thing when I, oh, when it was first in stores. This thing had Windows 98 second edition. Well, guess what we're going to do now, folks? I'm going to stop recording and I'm just going to install Windows 98 second edition and put it back in the compact. And then I'll install the drivers for that. Um, I think I'll make another video. This one will be called Installing Windows 98 Second Edition Next. So, stay tuned, folks.